be on the lookout for the Breton called Marcus Wright. He is an enemy to the Thalmor and has actively disrupted our activities and caused great harm. If spotted, you are to destroy him with extreme hatred. Be advised, he is extremely dangerous and quite able to defend himself. If caught by local authorities, we are unable to offer you any assistance for the glory of the Altmeri Dominion. Excuse me? Bloody hell. I... You guys attacked me because I was standing near a Thalos shrine. Going to have some fun today, yes? Well, I hope so, Inigo. God. Yes, I... Stopped them from doing what they were doing because they were attacking me. There. Okay, this is just another proof that the Eldmary Dominion and the Thalmor are just not to be trusted. No, we are just going to randomly attack someone and not even let him defend himself with words. We just attack him. Sounds easy, right? Why would we let him talk? That would only cost too much paperwork. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so if we follow this main road, we cross the bridge over here through the mountains to the Forgotten Ruins. Well, hopefully without any Thalmor issues on the side although that were some very nice moves Inigo some very nice moves makes me kind of wish I was as good as you with a sword but I'll take pride in me being better with magic which we will need when we encounter Saber cats. Ow! Ooh. Inigo, I appreciate the fact that you wanted to jump in front of it, but you surprised me. You did. I thought I don't want to hit you, so I am going to be very careful. Just don't jump in front of me when I'm trying to fire spells or try to block with my shield. I don't want to hurt you. Don't want to hurt you at all. I saw some watery smoke. Something. Eh. Words. Difficult. Pronunciation. I thought there was a waterfall around here. Oh, the roads are very full with saber cats. I'm doing this out of self-defense. Come on there. Thought so. Ow. Okay. Painful. Are you okay? I it could be better. It could definitely be better. Definitely be better. Oh. I need some proper armor. But these robes, they are really helping me out with casting spells. But on the other hand, having no armor, ah, uh, it's uh, annoying, difficult. Please, don't be bandits. Be storm cloaks? Yes, storm cloaks. Oh, I'm happy seeing storm cloaks. That's good. Morning. Good morning, indeed. Oh, look at that sight. That's just beautiful. <laughs> okay, so is this the bridge I was talking about? No, we need to have one a little bit further ahead. Which makes us go past here. We can do that. I see a wolf on the other side, so it's a good idea we went this way. Also, was that iron ore or gold? The shine is difficult to see. It's iron. But, iron or gold? Either way, it's good. And the final 
few swings and there we go ah. you know you're free to grab a pickaxe and mine for yourself too and you go if you want so we are getting off of the path just don't don't attack me don't attack me don't attack me don't attack me I said no don't do it I really wish Muntcraps would be able to understand us. Although, on the other hand, maybe Muntcraps think the same about us. They want us to understand them. Oh, in you go! Wolves! Nice one. Huh. I'm glad I'm getting the hang of this spell. Yes, run away. If you can try. I'm trying to use this spell a little bit with tactical thinking. He was coming towards me. I placed the position of the spell on the side of him. So you would be able to attack him. Without him noticing you. That's the general idea. Sorry if it all doesn't always work. It's I'm not a tactical thinker. Well, I try to be, but I'm not great at it. There's a reason I don't join in wars and stuff. Ow, ow, ow. Really? Bloody mud crabs. Yes, I was attacking your friend, but... That did not give you the right to attack me. Either way, bridge. This is the one we were talking about. This is the one we need to get across the river. Leave the bear alone. Leave the bear alone. Be nice to the bear. If we are nice to the bear, he's over there. He isn't bothering us. There is a town over there. Mm. Now, nah, we still have supplies. Ooh, another shrine. And some Dwemer architecture. Tiny bits. Hmm. Shrine of Dibella. Huh. Nice. Okay, I think we can move on again. Markov shouldn't be too far away now. We must be able. No, oh, no, 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 no. No, ow, 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 ow. I wouldn't call that weak. Oh. I would not call that weak. Ah, those tusks. Whew. Well, at least I'm getting better with restoration. But not in the way I want to get better at restoration. Whew. Bristlebacks, okay, they can be persuaded into not attacking me. Durzox, a totally different story. Bloody annoying things, that's what they are. Almost as annoying as those little munchkins. Let's hope it's just one Durzog and not more. Because I don't like the idea of fighting more. Okay, we need to go a little bit further ahead and then to the left, not here. There should be a path going upwards to the left on that side. Which will hopefully be enough for us. Greetings. Greetings, brother. You look weary. I have something to help you relax if you're interested. What are you talking about? The finest skooma. No, 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 sugar, no. At a fair price, of course. No. By the way, this doesn't seem legal. Ah, uh, a snitch, eh? Can't have you running through any guards now, can I? Oh, can't you? You're as good as dead. No. I'm not letting you sell skooma knowing how much trouble it gave my friend. Stand a chance. You deserve that one. 
That's what all the skooma is selling. I'm, I'm taking the moon sugar though, because I might be able to use it. Skooma, we are... I'm taking it, just in case someone else uses it. Just... I'll keep it away from you, Indigo. I'll keep the skooma away from you. And apparently Kain wants us to kill another mud crab. I'll take it. Although... I need some practice with my bow. This is a perfect opportunity to try that out. Uh, Orcs bow of metal diction. I'll take that one. Okay. Let's see. And... There we go. Almost. Haha, <laughs> got it. See, I am good with it, but it's eh, sometimes difficult. I learned this from you, I think. Oh, we need to be this. We need to go this way, not further ahead. This is the path going up. I'm curious though, that Dwemer rune, riches beyond imagining. Oh, plus the brother, the main reason we're going there is to help that brother out or at least to find the brother and help the sister out find the brother for the sister um although we mustn't get lost so i think yeah this way this way mm, riches beyond imagining well i can imagine a bear who will most likely not get out of our way. Here you go. No. Get away. Nope. Ah, oh, teamwork. I love it. What would I be without you, Inigo? I mean, that Dursa could have probably tried to heavily kill me. Surely. Well, that's a Dwemer ruin. At least it looks Dwemerish. I don't like running around in random rooms. I mean, the Dwemer are known from the stories from traps and everything. So we need to be on our guard. Also for wolves. Although that one wasn't that big of a problem. Others are. Others most definitely are. So we're still going in the right direction, I think. Or are these the runes that we... I don't think this is where we need to be, but... Hmm. We can take a quick look. A small look. Rint... Well, Rint... Reach Wind Eerie. Not Rint Reach Eerie, but... Hmm. What are we dealing with? That. What the? What the heck's going on? What? What? What the heck is going on? Why is. That's a ghost? Please don't. Why is. What the? Hello? Um. Tidings. What the heck just happened? Ah, a visitor. Word travels fast, it seems. As fast as time flies. Which makes sense, given that they're both a type of bird. Um... No doubt. Okay. You came for the Argonian known as Two Tails. I am he. Okay. Um... I've never heard of you. Impossible. 
You speak to the first hero of the fourth era, blessed by the divines with a great and ancient power. With it, I will vanquish a great evil that has returned from centuries of slumber. A third one? And now threatens the very fabric of our world. Are you talking about Alduin That's or the Doomstrider right. or? You would have guessed it uh, had I not told you two seconds from now. I am Dwarvenborn. You're what? Uh, wait. The, the Legend of Dragonborn? D Dragonborn? Hmm? Do I look like I have wings? No, I have horns and feathers and walk on three feet. Just like dwarves. If you say Besides so. Besides, in war, fire is best fought with fire. And you don't bring a dragon to a dwarf fight, not unless it's <clears throat> Dwarvenborn. Nothing else can combat the infinite armies of Mazenach, <laughs> the God Eater. I'm terribly confused. Who's Mazenach? I'm not sure, are you being serious or not? Are we dealing with the third world-defeating evil besides Alwyn and the Doomstrider? Your worst enemy and your best friend, as you are nothing but a dog to him. And like a good doggy, he's going to make you fetch dirt, then bring it to the surface while his army of centurions flog you with brass whips. Mazenach aims to devour the gods, at least the ones that live underground, and in doing so, propel our world into chaos. But as it is written in the Histbark and inscribed in the assortment of spoons I keep in my pocket, all is not lost. For there is one that even the Mad Dwarf and his legion of machines fear. In their tongue, I am known as Thuamurzin, Dwarvenborn. Question. Have you by any chance been buying skooma from a certain other Oregonian who was on the road not too far from here because I have a very, very big feeling that might be the case. But if you're in this dwarven born, why are you staying in this tower? It's the only place that's completely safe. Mazenok has his spiders everywhere, hiding in the dirt like eight legged mud crabs. They're out there right now, burrowed in the mud, not 40 paces from where we stand, using the grass and the weeds like an insect's antenna. Only these antenna aren't like the kind you find on a bug. No, attached at the end are magical listening spheres, painted white to look like flowers. Cut in bows, fungal pods, tulips. Tulips. His eyes and ears are everywhere, searching for the one they call Dwarvenborn. Conversely, there isn't a section of wall or piece of dwarven metal that I haven't blessed with my machine hand. It's completely quarantined. Okay. Um, anyway, good luck with the whole uh, God Eater and stuff like that. So, uh, continue your journey, Dwarvenborn. Goodbye. 
Walk away slowly, walk away slowly. How can I help you? Loot whatever... Dear God, that is a lot of... Fierce ramblings. Guess, 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 guess. We had... Clutter... Creates an enormous force that throws around clutter for 10 seconds. These objects will cause damage if they hit someone. I'll take it, but... That explains the entire buzzing around the place. I does not explain the crazy Argonian. I really, really think we were dealing with a little bit of an overdoses of skooma. <laughs> I'm glad we're outside, Iniko. Whew. You okay? Something on your mind? <gasps> Gears. I'm thinking, what is Mr. Dragonfly thinking? Probably gears. Okay, let us get back to it. All the gears. I I don't know. 